we are all aware of what he is doing and we really appreciate for that matter we want him to continue yeah a lot of challenges with healthcare center he come and that was his second term he made the healthcare center for Bonsu Gwanda people. Now we are not fixing any problem over there. About what he did is helping the farmers and the youth with the Gabosu people here. And so when we left office, I mean the NDC left office, they abandoned that particular facility. And then the community people came to me and said, look, you lobbied for the construction of this particular project. So if the assembly is not continuing the project, we expect you to continue the project. If you abandon it, the, the why in opposition will use it against you. And it's a taxpayer's money as well. Of course, that you are thinking about the patriotic aspect of it. Let's even go into, I mean, political idiosyncrasy. Right. Like, look, what, what is the advantage or the disadvantages in abandoning the project? I don't, I don't, I don't see any sense in it. Probably you may go to that site. We have only one government secondary school or senior high school in this constituency. Now the previous regime started a day school. You know the 200 senior high school that uh, President Mahama promised. Is that why in this constituency? Go and say it's been taken away. It's been taken over by the bush. Or weeds all over. You go the weeds. Yes, grass cutters and uh, <laughs> rats and what have you have taken over. Can you imagine? Wow. You see, you go to some places, it's 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 almost completed, but it's been abandoned. Yeah.